Welcome back, Summit County. You're watching Summit Sunrise this morning. I'm Lauren. I'm here with Jan. We are now inside the Riverwalk Center, but if you come by the Riverwalk Center, you'll definitely be able to see we're kicking off the International Snow Sculptor Championship. We were outside earlier today, but our camera froze, so <laughs> we needed to come inside to the Elite Sculptures Lounge. So here we are hanging out inside now, but definitely make sure you come by the Riverwalk Center and check it out. It's a really fun time. So, like I said, I'm here with Jan. Good morning. Good morning. How are you? I am great today. I'm, I'm kind of glad that the camera froze. It's really cold outside. <laughs> <laughs> so, you are here with us this morning for Slifer Smith & Frampton. Can you tell me a little bit about this company? Well, mm -hmm. what I'm going to go through right now is, is I've got some market stats that are really exciting for uh, Dece December uh, 2015. Uh, Summit County uh, residential market had reached the billion dollar mark this December uh, since uh, 2007 and in 2015 sales volume is up 22 percent uh, over 2014 um, 1.02 billion dollars in residential real estate sales the um, actual number of transactions is up less by about 13 percent um, compared to uh, uh, 2014 and so we're, we're taking in and looking at average sales prices uh, going up a little bit higher um, at that time and um, now we're looking at a market a price of about five hundred and sixty eight thousand dollars and that's up approximately fifty thousand dollars from December 2014 so the residential um, sold price per square foot has uh, is um, up now as well to um, three hundred and sixty three dollars Wow. so what does this sorry if I'm naive I don't know anything about selling or buying a house what does this mean for the average person who's looking to buy or sell a house <laughs> that the, it now is the time to take and buy because prices are going up okay okay yeah. great yeah. so that's really great information <laughs> so what one and one reason why the um, prices um, you know ha, is the average price is, is up can is likely contributed to our uh, luxury market. Um, and what we found is in 2015 we had 196 sales in um, residential properties over a million dollars wow. and so that number, the actual number of luxury market transactions is up 36 percent over 2014 and that's nearly doubled since 2011. Wow. So what we're seeing is in our residential sold price per list price is, um, has greatly climbed over the last five years and currently now is averaging 97 percent. Wow. Wow, that's incredible. <laughs> so great to know a little bit about the market. Do you have any properties that you'd like to highlight as well that you have on the market right now? Well, I have a, I have a unique property that's coming on the market soon. I'll be listing it this week and it is um, a three miles out of town. It's a fixer-upper, so if there's any investors that are looking for something like that, it's a three-bedroom, three-bath. It was built in 1965, and it is on 1.2 acres that is right along the Blue River, so it's on, on Blue River frontage. Um, that's and that's gonna be priced at $475,000. Yeah, well, that's a great location, and it seems like a, I mean, you said it's a fixer-upper, but that seems like a really great price for this area, especially. <laughs> Yeah. <laughs> cool. So if somebody wants to find out more information or contact you directly, how can they find out more? Um, I'm at 117 South Main Street, um, downtown location um, in Breckenridge, and um, my uh, number is 970-389-3714. My website is searchbreckenridgelistings.com. Great. Well, Jan, you, thanks for sharing with us that great information and looking forward to this new property that you have, even though it is a fixer for That's kind of fun. My dad... I'm going to tell my dad about that. He loves fixer-uppers. <laughs> well, yes, thank you so much. And before you guys came to us, I think we had the watch and win question. So we're going to go back to the studio now to find out who the winner is and the watch and win answer.